Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today is a normal homeschool day in the life. I don't have too much going on <clears throat> because we have a grocery pickup. And then, as you know, it's not just about the groceries. It's a, you pick them up, you bring them home, and then you, you got to put them away and clean out the fridge. And so, Donovan, my six-year-old, he just needs to do a phonics lesson and a math science lesson to finish out our week. Everyone else is pretty much done, but I probably will go ahead and just do a phonics lesson with Jessica or do some of our, we'll call it like the annex stuff to language arts, which is writing, grammar, and vocabulary. Okay. Other than that, and I might do like a little lesson with Benjamin, but other than that, the main focus is groceries, packing up our softball and t-ball bags, making sure we have everything we need for tomorrow. We'll be out there all day. We have two games, one I'm at 9 a.m. Perfect. Okay. Okay, sit on mommy's bed and I hope you get dressed. Got one chickadee in here brushing his teeth with me and I'm going to get him dressed and kind of start our whole morning routine, but I will most likely check back in with you guys once we get our groceries, I guess. What time is it? <clears throat> Yeah, so it's 9 o'clock. We have to get them at 11. So it's going to take me all this time to get all five kids properly together. And yeah, so welcome to my day in the life. I hope you guys are having a great day. I just realized that I don't have to cook dinner tonight. Well, all I have to do is heat up some leftovers. And um, so today is a sushi day and my daughter cooked breakfast so I've had some time off in the kitchen today and um so I'm excited about that and that means look at these see look I'm doing laundry see that I'm doing laundry so I am a real mom I have real things <laughs> um but anyway so yeah we are on our way to get sushi um my grocery order should be ready in no time and so yeah all right guys let's load the car up we had a quick change of plans because once we, i got in the car i sat in there and i just thought to myself we have some time, so let's just take this 15, 20 minutes and get the trash out of the car. That way, when I got back, we were able to just vacuum it. And I just sat in it and I was just so disgusted. So I had a bag, my daughter had a bag, and my son had a bag. We just got all the trash out of the car. Let me know in the comments if you ever get like this. Okay, so we're at Walmart waiting on our order. Samari is asleep. Mom, I see some clumps here. Samari was asleep. He woke up in a coffin fit. Mom, so. I see some clumps on here. Oh, yeah. We got to clean that out. Yeah. No Good. problem at all. Thank you. I appreciate it. I can see it. They're too tiny. Thank you. Maybe yeah. the crackers from it. They, they forgot part of my order, so they had to go I sent the crackers from okay, it, Mommy. I would have been highly upset if I got home. And more than half of my order was missing. But anyway, I'll check in back in with you guys in a little bit. Donovan, pull your pants up. We see your boxers, buddy. <laughs> Alright guys, so we are back from our little meat pickup from Harris Teeter and our Walmart haul. I'm going to go ahead and just show you what I got from Walmart, not Harris Teeter, because I showed you while I was there. Alright, so we, of course, Pampers, we got 
two butts to change. Toilet paper, chips, um, vinegar. I this I use this as cleaning vinegar solution. Ramen, paper plates, and right here we have some applesauce. Um, so we have some naan for naan pizzas for lunch. I'm gonna make a salad, so I have tons of stuff for salad. Tomatoes, red peppers, cucumbers. I have no idea why I got two bananas. <laughs> I think I thought I was buying organic because organic comes in the bundle and I think I pressed two when I should have did like 10 <laughs> and so we have a cantaloupe we have corn so let's see five out of seven people eat corn in the house so that's why it's not like a whole bunch we have some kiwi strawberries apples we have so many oranges because for Jesse's game we are in we're responsible for bringing oranges for their snack um, and then there's like someone else bringing drinks and someone else bringing chips or like another like uh, crunchy snack. Uh, so I have some mushrooms, potato, red potatoes, bacon. Tomorrow morning, I think I'm just going to make, we have to be out there at, at 8.30. So I think I'm just going to make some, no, I'm sorry, we have to be out there at 9.30. So I'm just going to make some um, bacon, egg and cheese sandwiches, I think. Either we have to be there 8.30 or 9.30, but yeah, we're going to have a quick breakfast. Some grapes, mangoes, strawberry cream cheese, some dairy-free vanilla yogurt, salad mix, some sausage on a stick for quick breakfasts, fish sticks, eggos, can't go wrong with dino nuggets, um, some fish for fish sandwiches, um, chicken fingers, these are always good for like a quick Sunday morning. We have these with some eggs and bacon. Um, these are really good. Some mozzarella cheese. This was a substitution that I told them I did not want, but it still ended up in my bag. This as well. Um, so I guess we can figure out how to have some egg whites. This was substituted for my just egg. If you don't know, I'm the resident vegan. Some eggs that are, half of them are cracked. Yeah, half of them are cracked. Um, and then we have some, um, what is this? <laughs> Seaweed, some French toast sticks, fig bars for a nice snack. Me and the students love those. Some patties, pat, um, I can't even think of it. <laughs> Hash browns, some ranch dressing. These are really good, and the peanut butter ones are really good, too. These are good, and they're plant-based. For a mama snack, um, mac and cheese, some almond extract and vanilla extract, some Uncrustables, some pot stickers, barbecue sauce, cream of chicken. I like to cook, sear some chicken in a, um, in a cast iron pan and then finish it in the oven with this on top. So good. The family loves this. Um, no salt sodium, no salt black beans, some butter chicken simmer sauce. Um, this is a great snack. I love these nice and sweet. I don't think it's vegan though. Could be vegan, but I don't think the, I think it has to do with the sugar that, this is where the sugar comes from. But anyway, that's good. Some regular pasta, angel hair pasta, um, marinara sauce for pizzas, and we're gonna have meatballs, spaghetti and meatballs one day. Just some, um, this is all the snacky stuff. <laughs> um, graham crackers, regular crackers. Oh, this was substituted as well. We like the, not Ancho Mama anymore, but the Pearl Milling Company. So, I guess we'll figure that out. I, I told them to put that back too. Um, goldfish, cheese it variety of sorts. Oh, twins already got into the applesauce. Marshmallows for, I'm going to make some, I already have the Rice Krispies, so I'm going to make some Rice Krispie treats for them. Popcorn, popcorn, more seaweed, vanilla wafers, bunions. And then sandwich bags, some bug repellent. We do not play about them bugs when we're out there on them fields. Um, some Dawn, just all around good cleaning. Avocado oil, snacks for the twins, some strawberry bars, 
ginger ale, some little cups, just all purpose cups if they want some juice or if they're painting, I like to use those for like art projects and stuff. Some Clorox, this smells really good. Some soap for my hubby, soap for the kids. We used to use the squirt dove sensitive for the kids, but they just would squirt, especially the boys. They would squirt it in one sitting, the big one. So we switched them to the bar because they can't abuse that. <laughs> and then also some Colgate toothpaste. So I'd love to say that I have our meal plan figured out for the next week, but I don't. The only thing I know for sure that we're having is the spaghetti and meatballs, the chicken portions simmered in the, the cream of mushroom sauce. We'll most likely have wings and then I guess we'll have butter chicken, but I don't know. I don't think that that's going to be on our list for right now because I feel like we just had it. I tried to not cook the same thing. I tried to have a month of food that doesn't repeat. So we'll see. And yeah, so that's it for my groceries. I'm going to go ahead and put these away. Of course, I haven't eaten yet. So I'm going to eat as well. And the kids are upstairs, but I'm going to call them down and have me help me. What do you guys think? All right, it is what time is it i don't know what time it is it is 3 36 i somebody scratched me while i was trying to get her down for a nap but i just put the twins down for a nap the kids are inside cleaning it's like a forecast like look there's storm clouds over us so i'm not gonna get the outside of the car clean but i'm gonna clean the inside um we just have lots of stuff everywhere so i'm gonna clean it with some of this tahini grapefruit splash and get these mirrors and stuff clean because uh there's all kinds of stuff on the glass but essentially i just feel like i'm cleaning the car <laughs> so they can get back dirty tomorrow <laughs> as we're in and out towards the baseball games but anyway uh yeah so i'm about to clean up mopping i got some baked potatoes started and like i said donovan still has to start um some science so we're going to i'm currently using fusion science have you guys used this before? and so i'm gonna sit with him and do some of this and then maybe we'll get started with some phonics we shall see no Yes. Absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. Okay, here's your pencil, baby. So I want you to use your body to show how living things grow.
5.19, so it took us 10 minutes, 11 minutes. And so for, we are gonna get started on phonics, but for a little warm up, I'm gonna have him, this is from the preschool curriculum that I have. I'm gonna have him just identify, draw a path for the frog through the letter F. I can't make the frog. Here you go, baby. Okay. So you're gonna get the frog to the pond. So draw a path from the frog to the lily pad by following the letter F. Then we're having leftover Brussels sprouts. I had to do, I did have to make new baked potatoes. So I'm going to put these in the oven on 350 until the cheese melts. And then I've already started chopping up some um, lamb, but some lamb chops. That's all we're having for dinner. The kids are out or um, watching movies, so they didn't want to <laughs> mute the TV anymore. So I came out in the garage to end the video. Thank you for watching. If you haven't heard today, please know that Heavenly Father loves you. Don't forget to drink your water and repent. Bye.